1-800-242-5280. You are back on Get Down to Business. I'm your host, Shalom Klein, joined over the phone by Abby Weisberg, CEO of Keshet. Abby, welcome to the program. Abby, welcome to the program. Are you on with us? I'm on. Okay, can fantastic. Yes, now we can hear you. Abby, welcome to Get Down to Business. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me. So, Abby, has it really been 33 years of Keshet? It seems like yesterday, but it has been 33 years of Keshet. And we've, uh, we- we've weathered the, the years, and we're, we're strong and doing well and growing. Strong and mighty. Uh, so tell, for our listeners that aren't familiar with Keshet, tell us about the work that you do in helping children and young adults with special needs. Well, Keshet is an organization that provides year-round programming for individuals with uh, developmental or intellectual challenges. And we accommodate, you name it, and we, 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 we serve those people um, from a range of disabilities to a range of abilities. And um, what's unique really about this organization is that though we have a Jewish mission, we also take care of um, many people within our organization who are not Jewish. And what people love about Kesha is the fact that we're a family, the fact that we're able to um, bring people together who in a world where it can be very isolating, we bring people together. And along the lines that make us unique are the fact that we've been doing inclusion uh, or mainstreaming before people even knew what that word meant. It's so, amazing. Uh, and next Sunday, we're celebrating 33 years of service. The theme of the uh, of the banquet is stand together, and we are standing together. Inclusion, standing together, celebrating the uh, the, the hard work and dedication of many volunteers and, and folks that have given so much to help the organization, like uh, United States Congresswoman Jan Schakowsky. Uh, she's receiving an award. But also, uh, this show is all about small business. So honoring Athletico, tell us about the uh, special relationship that Keshet has with that great uh, business organization. Well, you're right. We what, The part that makes Keshet unique is the fact that we're a family, and we individualize every opportunity we can for every every team member, every participant, every camper, every student. And we've grown as our kids have grown. So, for example, uh, the few people that we have, because we are mighty and and, and growing, the people that we have working at Athletico, when I met with Mark Kaufman, who's the CEO of Athletico, and Jeff Hayes, his right hand, uh, who built the company from from a, a storefront, uh, it was a great story. When I hear them mention by name our students, their employees, it is so heartwarming. They know each person by name, and um, they didn't ask how were we going to do this. They asked when could we start, and we'll figure out all the rest. So they're going and, to be the uh, we're going to be celebrating them as the employer of the year, which is so exciting and so uh, well deserved. As mentioned, also honoring uh, United States Congresswoman Jan Schakowsky and the special guests of honor are Simon Lesser and Carol Patinkin. What have they done? Oh, what have Simon and Carol done? They are parents that every organization dreams of having. They are parents that have partnered with uh, the teachers when Avi, their son, was very young. And Abby has Williams syndrome. And Carol has worked as she's been board chair. I, I believe her husband Simon has also been board chair. And they never let the needs of their own child mark any one of their uh, decisions in growing the organization. They always had all the children's best interest at heart. When so, they so many governed. good people. So many good people supporting such a good cause. And aside for uh, the, the people being recognized, it's also it's a, it's a fun evening, and it's taking place next Sunday. Uh, we're, Abby, tell us how people can register. Tell us where the event's going to be, and tell us about the special uh, guest speaker. Well, the event is going to be held at the Sheraton Chicago downtown, where we expect to have over 13, uh, between 13 and 1,400 people uh, attending uh, Chicago Philanthropists. And Ed Asner of the Mary Tyler Moore Show, who is both a father and a grandfather 
of a child with autism will be our keynote speaker. And everyone there is really there for the recognizes the work that Kesha has done. We're known locally, we're known nationally, and, and we're known now internationally. So it's just it's just exciting. And um, if you want to come and be inspired or you want to learn more about our programs, you can always go to www.keshet.org or you can call our main office at 847-205-1234. Ask for me, Abby Weisberg, and I'm always happy to guide or direct you as to um, whom you should speak with regarding what program or how you can get involved. Fantastic. Abby Weisberg of Kesha, that uh, banquet celebrating 33 years of service, great organization, taking place next Sunday the 8th at the Sheridan Chicago Register at Keshet.org. Thank you, Abby, for joining us on Get Down to Thank Business. Thank you so much, Shalom, for, for letting the world know about what we're doing and keep up the good work. So excited. After the break, we're talking with former Congressman Joe Walsh, host of Walsh Freedom, host of, of uh, so much good stuff. We're going to be talking about uh, how Governor Rauner is trying to shake up Springfield and is he doing a good job. And maybe, maybe I'll be able to, to get Joe to come along with me to the Kesha Banquet. We'll talk about that after the break. You're listening to Get Down to Business, the show that's all about small business, jobs, and entrepreneurship. Don't touch that dial.